Hi everyone, this is Esther Camacho with the McAllen Public Library and I'm here with my colleague Julia. Uh, welcome to another episode of Visions in Time. We are here at the Basilica of Our Lady the Valle in San Juan, Texas. Are you familiar with the shrine here in San Juan? If not, let me tell you some of its history. In 1949, the Reverend Aspiazu who was the pastor of the parish of St. John the Baptist in San Juan, Texas, believed that a devotion to Our Lady of San Juan would bring the community here together. He proposed the idea to the bishop. When the bishop agreed, an artist from Guadalajara, Mexico, was commissioned to make a reproduction of the statue that was honored in the town of San Juan de los Lagos in Mexico. The statue was placed in the San Juan Chapel. In 1954, a shrine was finally built. On October 23, 1970, tragedy struck here. While celebrating Mass at the time were a large number of priests and parishioners. And in a nearby cafe, a large number of children were being assembled there. And at that time, a pilot of a small airplane crashed into the roof of the shrine and burst into flames. The entire shrine was destroyed. With an estimated loss of over one million dollars, the only fatality was the pilot of the plane. The statute of Our Lady of San Juan de Valle was rescued and the Blessed Sacrament was saved before the altar was engulfed in flames. Thousands of people from far and near, and from all walks of faith, came to view the destroyed sanctuary. Many in disbelief of what occurred in this small town. On April 19, 1980, a new shrine was dedicated with thousands of people in attendance. In 1998, the National Conference of Catholic Bishops designated Our Lady of San Juan de Valle a national shrine. In 1999, Pope John Paul II designated as a minor basilica. This is Esther Camacho and my colleague Julia, and thank you for watching this episode of Visions in Time. Don't forget to leave a comment below and to like us on Facebook at MPL Adults, and subscribe to our YouTube channel at McAllen Public Library. So see you next time for another episode of Visions in Time.